Hi, it's John. It's the 12th of November and we're just going off on a little photo expedition. Um, we've had about a week or so of bad weather and now we've got... Um, well, it's bad, but uh, um, there's the hint that there might be some sunshine. So that's what we're hoping. We're armed with several cameras and two people, so that could be an advantage. You know, more people, more chance of getting some decent shots. What is it, that um, wild carrot? You no, know, is it? Was it? To start with. To start with, now you've seen something else. I'm not quite sure how to make it. I'm still just down by the road and uh, there's a badger set down here. It doesn't look that active, um, but we're near Badger Watch oh, um, and also, um, uh, well, there's quite a lot of badger sets around here, but they are going to have a cull um, because of uh, cattle disease, brucellosis, I think. They think it spreads to milking cows, but we had a rogue badger kill a lot of chickens, or not a lot, but it caused trouble in the area. And then there was a badger killed on the road here, and that stopped. It stopped then, so I think the rogue badger actually got killed on the road. Um, so I'm not that sympathetic to badgers. I love these trees where they've bent with the wind. That's the village of Henley down there. It's more or less entirety. The um, two houses, number one and two council houses, have had their pebble dash painted. They're both privately owned. And number three, privately owned. Number four is uh, owned by Magna Housing. And number five, six is privately owned, and uh, so, and then these white ones in the foreground here, they're known as Henley Cottages, and the one at the end of that row, in the middle there, that's an old Methodist chapel, which has been converted into a home, and the, the building beyond it is a garage with a studio over the top. <laughs> 